Hey guys, I'm doing a review. Um, first I'll start off by saying I have two um, channels. This one, CB Miller 128, is the channel that I use for mostly everything. And then I have another channel called Make Makeup for Every 110. And um, that channel I've been kind of slacking on because I've been really focusing on this channel here. So I'm making the decision that for right now I'm going to like, upload videos on both channels. But slowly start to fade the other one out because I'm on this one, the CB Miller 128, a lot more often than the other one. So, I'm like, because usually on this CB Miller 128, I usually do like all my contest giveaway entries and things like that. And the other one is where I do my own tutorials, my own hauls, and things like that. So, I'm pretty much now going to combine them together under the CB Miller 128, but it's going to take a minute for that, that to go into effect. So, this is my first combined video type deal. But I'm going to do a review on the e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set. It's from the Studio Line. It's $3. And I was, I've been looking for um, a makeup setting spray, especially because it's summertime. And I try to, I like to wear my makeup, of course, like everyone else does. And I try to go for um, the waterproof products and um, things like that. I needed something that makes everything stand as much as possible. So I found this one because right at the when I was at Target, I saw it. I'm like, well, let's give it a try. It's three dollars. You know, if I don't like it, then you know, no biggie. I'll live and I'll find something better or whatever. Or even just to test out how I like a makeup setting spray and then go for maybe something more expensive or a better brand. Um, but the elf isn't good. I like I like elf. I got a lot of elf stuff. But anyway, so I got this setting spray, and the first thing about it that I don't like is the smell. It stinks. It smells like to me like old sweaty gym socks. You know, like going like to a guy's locker room and that smell. That's what it smells like to me. So I don't necessarily like that smell whatsoever. The first time I used it, I guess I didn't wait long enough after like applying mascara and such, so I sprayed it and then I had mascara under my eyes, so that was awesome, so I had to clean it off and like fix it and stuff like that, so then I learned, okay, well, I have to wait a little bit before, um, before applying the setting spray, um, so after that, then it was, it's been beautiful. I use, been using it every morning, um, at night. Spray it all over. I close my eyes and I hold it back like this far from my face. Spray it, and it works beautifully. It's a nice spritz on your face. Your face is nice and cool down. And actually, it does say you can use it for like to set your set your makeup, but also to like a refresher. So like say if you know go out the day and you're starting to look a little dull in your makeup, spray it on, and it's supposed to help bring some life back into your makeup. So I liked that idea as well. Um, I only have one. I should have bought another one. I'm able to go out and get another one having my purse with me to to use it as a refresher. Especially when it's hot out. Psh, psh, spray that on. It feels nice. Um, it has held up. I have to say, I was pleasantly surprised that, you know, even where I live, it's very humid. And even on days that it's really humid out, it's still holds everything in place like it should be and I like that that you know I don't feel like I don't have to have to check and make sure my eyeliner is not under my eyes or anything like that which is something I used to do all the time and make sure that it wasn't and this the formulation of it is fantastic I would definitely buy this product again the only downside is is the smell that's the only downside so if I find something around the same price and it smells better, I would definitely invest my money in this. Um, if you can get past the smell and you think it might smell okay or different, then by all means, enjoy that. I like the product regardless, of, even though it does smell really stinky to me. But that's my review. Definitely recommend the e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Setting Spray. Um, perfect for this time of year because it really does keep everything in place like it needs to be. So that's my review. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you guys go out and go pick one of these bad boys up. And this was not a sponsored video. I bought this with my own money because I wanted to try it. But I want to tell you guys about it too to make sure 
you to include in as well. So thanks guys. Bye.